help getting ready for next week's PSAT. A record-breaking performance earns the Athlete of the Week. One class makes Halloween decorations and much more. We are RHS. And, and we, we are On The Air. air. Hi, I'm Maddie Sweet. And I'm Scott Wampler. Next Wednesday, over 500 RHS students will be testing for the PSAT and SAT. All sophomores and about 60 juniors will take the PSAT, and if any of them want to get ready, here is some help through Khan Academy. Welcome to official SAT practice. Khan Academy and the College Board have teamed up to create the only SAT practice tool developed with the experts who write the SAT. It's personalized for each student, available anytime, anywhere, and completely free. We'll create personalized practice recommendations for you, based on your test results from the PSAT 8-9, PSAT 10, PSAT NMSQT, and SAT. If you haven't already taken a College Board test, you can take our short diagnostic quizzes to get started. Your practice plan will show you where you already excel and where you should focus your practice. We'll also create a practice schedule for you based on your test date. We have tons of interactive practice questions developed with the College Board that give you instant feedback on your answers, as well as hints and videos to help you master your skills. Mini sections help you practice under time pressure. We have official practice tests written by the College Board. Taking at least two practice tests will help you build the experience and endurance necessary to do well on test day. Join more than 1 million students already using official SAT practice. Khan Academy was probably the best way that I can use to study. My math was below par. Using Khan Academy, I built it up. It improved my scores dramatically. I like the leveling up. It kind of makes it a game. I feel excited and prepared because it's something that I've already seen, I've already prepped for it, so when I take it, I'm going to do it right. Sign up and get started today at satpractice.org. Now let's take a look at some highlights around RHS, including some interesting work being done by our machine tool class to help raise funds for their program. still time to order one of the Halloween decorations. Just see Mr. Wilson in the machine tool classroom by Tuesday next week. It's time again to find out who your go-to teachers at RHS are. Um, my go-to teacher would be Miss Stout because she's always very open and happy and exciting and I always remember going into her classroom freshman year and she always had music playing. My go-to teacher is Mr. Clark because he's already helped me a lot in the past and he's really kind and funny and not intimidating. Not necessarily a teacher, but a counselor. Uh, Stephanie Huber, Miss, Mrs. Huber to you, is definitely my go-to teacher. Uh, she is my coach, my counselor, she represents a parental figure to me, and she is just good to everyone, always in a good mood, always willing to help out. Love you. Um, my go-to teacher is definitely Mr. Lambright. Um, I have him for stats right now, and that class is always fun. He always makes me laugh. He always keeps me updated on, like, the new Fortnite challenges I need to get done. And, yeah, he's just a really good guy, and you can come to him about anything, and he'll give you advice. My go-to teacher is Mr. Rare, because he's always there for me no matter what, during basketball and personal issues. RHS football opened sectional play tonight at home against Newcastle, but it was a performance before fall break that gives us this week's Athlete of the Week. Wyatt Bird for his record-breaking 59 carry, 296-yard game against Anderson. 
I'm Deontay Gabbard. I'm with Athlete of the Week Wyatt Bird, who had two big games against Anderson and Kokomo. What led you to get six touchdowns in two games? Uh, well, the offensive line helped out a lot. The receivers uh, blocking down the field. Uh, Coach John Cini, my running back coach, uh, he helps out a lot with vision and uh, footwork, so that helps out a lot too during the games. How does it feel to lead your team to back-to-back -to -back NCC wins? Uh, it feels really good, uh, but it wasn't all on me. It was the, all the team, and it was a great team effort. What can we expect from you and the team going into sectionals? Uh, we're all going to give our 110% uh, full effort, and uh, hopefully we'll come out with the win. Thank you for your time, and good luck at sectionals. Thank you. Make sure to get out tonight and support the Richmond Red Devils. The Bleacher Creature theme for tonight is Red Devil Pride. Before we go today, it's time to congratulate those students with no tardies for all of last week. They were drawn at random, and they're going to receive a prize. Those students are Robert Ayala, Skylin Bradburn, Peyton Bryant, Cor Butler, India Feliz, Alyssa Hollingsworth, Matthew Miller, Vivek Patel, Ramin Sedijan, Skylar Wysong. Great job, and don't forget to see Ms. Parks and Mr. Amix's office to pick up your candy bar. That's our show. For On the Air, I'm Scout Wampler. And I'm Maddie Sweet. Have, Have a, a great, great weekend. weekend.